Hi friends, in our last lecture we created this pentagon and what we realized at the, by the end of lecture that our life is really going black and white and so let's make it colorful through this lecture. You're with me and Radha from learningmilestone.com and in this series we are learning Python concepts along with turtle graphics. Through this lecture we will learn to add colors to the shape which we have created through turtle. So let's go back to Rappel and add colors. So I'm continuing with my last lectures, Rappel. And uh, first we will learn how we can add background color to screen. So this is an instance of screen which we have created. And uh, to add background to this screen, we'll have instance dot instance name dot and uh, we'll use bg color method now what we can do we can pass primary colors like let's say try to pass blue okay and if i run it the screen becomes blue right but primary colors are limited so what we can do we can look for nice colors and hex codes right so let's say i choose this hex code and instead of the color name I pass hashtag and the color code. So what I did, I went here and I just clicked on it, copied the color code which I was liking and then I pasted it there. You can choose another sites also, let's say hex color codes, right? There are multiple sites for it. So you can go and get your um, color of your choice, right? In terms of hex code now if I run this I'll get my intended color on the background screen the other color which we wish to fill is inside the shape now there are two parts of the shape one is the outline and the other is within the shape so for outline we will set attribute to the turtle pen okay so we uh, remember our turtle is carrying a pen and we'll set an attribute which, which is by default black in color so pen color and within pen color i can again set a color name or any color if i want variety i can go to some hex code thing and then i can choose a color so let's say i choose this color and i put hash code control v so what does this do it changes the color of the pen so let me choose okay let me just take some other color over here um, so that we can clearly see that our shape is getting different color okay so that's it now what about filling the color inside so to fill the color inside i need to use something called lx dot not lx turtle name dot fill color so i'm setting the property fill color and uh, this just this won't help when from wherever i'm starting my shape or wherever i start want to start the filling of color there i'll mark this begin color and uh, uh, so this is lx dot begin color and similarly wherever i want to end i will say lx dot and color or whatever is your turtle's name right so let's see what happens right now we have not given any particular color and what will happen oh i'm sorry this is begin not begin color it is begin fill and end fill okay okay so let's run this okay so by default it has black color to fill now i can again pass any color let's say i pass pink color to it so when i run this it will fill it with pink color now what i can also do is i can comment these out and in one line i can do the same job so lx dot color will help me to do the same job if i pass only one color 
both outline and the fill color will be of the same type um, right and I can pass them as two oh, in two parts one is pen color first value is pen color and the second value is the fill color which we want to pass okay so let's run this so that's all about this lecture in, in our next lecture we'll be setting up more attributes of pen and we will look at how we can control different states of pen in turtle so let's go to next lecture